Castellano was an Italian mobster who spent a lot of time on the material things in life. One of them was his appearance. As a businessman, Castellano always stands out in the limelight wearing a suit in every photo. It was a miracle that he wasn't sleeping in his suit. So what made such mobsters wear suits and be stylish all the time? Want to know about it in detail? Well, stay tuned till the end. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will talk about why mob bosses are so stylish. Meanwhile, subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon. That being done, let's start. There's a reason Al Capone is considered one of the most stylish men in American history. His signature pinstriped silk suits imported from Italy put the Chicago mob scene on his fashion radar. Not only them, but also other gangsters look chic in their stylish suits. Aside from a gripping viewing experience full of gangsters, women, and all that's good about the 1920s, HBO's Boardwalk Empire shows just how stylish that gay era was. And here, we're going to dive into the reality of what made the men's style of this era so vibrant and dandy. Wearing authentic 1920s menswear isn't as easy as it seems. There's more to it than felt hats and granny suits, you know? Accessories are king if you want to look sharp, and there are different levels you can choose from. You can be a high-profile gangster like Nucky with flashy accessories and colorful clothes, a casual street hoodie with a leopard cap and melon hat, or you can dress up perfectly with bows, hats, square pockets, and buttons. A suit is a show of success. In the gang's mind, he is a businessman. In the business world, suits are considered uniforms for successful people. Gangsters wear suits to show that they are in the same league as the bosses who run these big companies. A well-tailored suit sets you apart from the rest. You're not just a regular criminal off with another day of drug dealing and theft. They are professionals who contribute to the economy through their businesses. Who cares if this business is legal? You are the boss and no one tells you what to wear and what not to wear. A suit is a show of wealth. Wealth is an integral part of success. Gangsters love to show off how much money they have by wearing expensive designer suits. What if you had to kill all those guys because they lost you a deal or looked at you weirdly? At least you look dashing in your grandma's outfit with a matching fedora hat. The fact is that the competition is very interesting, and the gangsters like to outdo each other not only by the amount of money they earn, but also by their wealth based on how much money they can fall on very valuable clothes. The body will be bloody and torn at the end of a normal business day. In the industry they operate in, impressions are almost as important as the size of your gun collection, an outfit that allows them to make a dramatic, even intimidating first impression. A suit is a show of power. Great power comes with a great suit. Yes, you read that correctly. For gangsters, suits reflect how they're always in control. Embark on risky surgeries in double-breasted suits with peak lapels and don't fear for your life. Reads. Ruin me and make you regret the day you were born or something far more menacing. A good suit is an investment because it will help you stand out as a professional, make a good impression and show confidence that you are in control of any situation. If there's anything to learn from gang life, a good suit can get you to the top. The gang put on suits to show that they are in the same league as the bosses who run these big companies. A well-tailored suit sets you apart from the rest. You're no ordinary criminal who's off for another day of drug dealing and theft. There is always a reason to wear black, and she wears red clothes under black. In the past, women wore red undershirts to commemorate all the blood they had to avenge. Today, especially when you're young, you often wear red lingerie. So what are your thoughts on this? Let us know in the comments below. And that's all for the day, guys. If you find the video interesting, make sure to hit the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update from us. Thank you for watching. We'll see you at the next one. Until then, peace.